Hey, what's up with him? It's your boy from Bartender Chronicles. Check it out. I got a couple things I wanted to say, you know what I'm saying? I got a lot of people and a lot of good people, a lot of people that just don't get, you know, what I do and how I do things. Okay, first of all, I know everybody think that I'm a career rapper. I'm not a career rapper. I like writing laughs. I like being creative. I like to do that, but I do that for just my, my own self, you know, I just, I love to be creative, I love to help people, you know what I'm saying, get on tracks and do stuff, I just like music, it's, I've always liked music, I know I disappeared for about 10 years or whatever, but, you know, I just stopped pushing for real for the music thing, you know, and a lot of people also know that I do screen printing, a lot of people also know, you know, I have a thing for uh, DJing, so, with this episode of Bartender Chronicles, I want to get down and let y'all know that I am getting back to my roots. I am getting ready to go back and take classes to do this DJ thing for the simple fact <laughs> it's totally different. I used to be able to get a pioneer and another pioneer in a mixer and get on there and start scratching and everything. And one of my uh, big homies, he taught me that, you know, back when we was doing the MU, CS, CMS shoes, uh, review little parties, and just DJing all over uh, Missouri and, you know, taking it, you know, further than that. Um, I, the reason why I want to do this is because I've been hearing a lot of new artists, and I'm talking about the younger generation. I've, I've been seeing some hot, artists out here and I mean just from seeing them performing and opening up for other artists man it's just like they not signed they're not um nobody's really pushing them you know and I've also I'm a big you know fan of Instagram I stay on Instagram all the time a lot of people that always ask me man we, we, we seen you ain't been on Facebook you ain't putting on no Facebook I don't really go on Facebook unless, you know, somebody, you know, tell me, hey, you know, so-and-so uh, doing this, you know, and doing that or something, somebody looking for you in the fam that I ain't talked to in a while or whatever. Yeah, I know I move around, you know, I've been in one state for five, six years, next thing you know, I'm in another one. That's just how I've been all my life. Everybody know that. Everybody that knows me know that. So if you didn't know, that's the facts. And yes, I am from St. Louis, but I was born in Minnesota. That's why I said Minnesota, East St. Paul, St. Louis, Missouri, nigga on your soft ass, you know, on my raps and stuff, because that's that's how it is. I was raised literally in Missouri, but I was born in Minnesota, but STL is home, you know. And I still bounce around, move from, you know, different states. Right now I'm located in Texas, and um, I'm liking Texas. I'm really liking it. I'm liking it a lot. Um, it's like, it's more diverse for me. Uh, you know, St. Louis is more black and white versus you come here and it is so many different uh, cultures and so many different uh, types of foods and everything where, I mean, it's, it opens your head up to different things, you know, and, and it actually helps you because you see things that you don't see in the Midwest, you know what I mean? But as far as that, yeah, it's all good. But just letting you know that I am not trying to be signed as no damn rapper. I'm not trying to be signed as nothing. I'm just, I love music. I love doing music. So these next couple of months, I'm going to be doing my training and stuff to learn this, uh, these different programs like, uh, what is it, Record Box and, uh, uh, Serato, and, you know, how to use the different ones and which ones would be the best ones for me to upgrade my controller to be able to DJ. And I actually want to put a lot of people, you know, music out there that I, I literally know that nobody's really uh, listening to. I mean, when I say that, I mean, like, they go on their page, man, they got like uh, 800 followers. You know, and their stuff is really good. And I'm not taking from nobody um, or trying to be negative on it. I just want to be able to DJ their stuff, put their stuff out there. You know, my ultimate goal is to be able to, you know, put other artists out there where people, you know, want to, you know, hear their music, buy their music, blah, 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 blah. That's just something that I want to do. That's something I'm going to do. It's not what I want to do. I'm going to speak that into existence. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to help you guys get heard. So, you know, in the next couple of months, if you feel like DMing me on Instagram or if you feel like uh, 
emailing me or if you feel like um, hitting me up on this YouTube, then all you got to do is just DM me. You know, you don't have to send me no tracks. Just get me to follow you. I'll follow you. And the songs that I really, really like, I mean, of course, it's not up to me because I ain't no, um, what you call, uh, pick the perfect songs or whatever because I listen to a lot of stuff other people don't listen to. And I also listen to stuff that people do listen to. So some of the popular stuff, yeah, is jamming and some of the stuff that people haven't heard be jamming. So I just want to give a shout out to like my boy Steve, a.k.a. Slink. Um, he kind of motivated me to get motivated me to get back into this. Uh, yep, Smooth D. Uh, he kind of motivated me to get back into this. My brother Flipmaster Big Mo, he kind of motivated me to get back into this. And I think that's where I should be, you know what I mean? So, I mean, hey, if y'all want me to go and um, plug some of y'all stuff, give me a while. Well, I ain't going to say a while, probably a couple months because I don't start my classes until uh, next week. So, once I get in there and know how to use this software stuff and do it like that, it's going to be cool because I only got a controller for now. I'm definitely going to be getting me some turntables. I've seen some DJs out there with their uh, laptops and stuff with actual turntables. And I am, I can jump in and be really good with some albums, but I just haven't, I don't know the process. So that's what's going on with me right now. Uh, I'm trying to stay focused and uh, I want everybody to, you know, like the comments, uh, subscribe to the page, the whole Nina Ross, why they woo. Alright, I don't know. What do you think? Should I be DJ King 225, DJ Feature, or just DJ Big Sway? Uh, leave a comment at the bottom. Let me know what you think. And everybody have a good day. And if you artists out there still jugging, hey, jam, jam, jam. DM me, get at me. We can make some things happen. I mean, as far as just stuff getting heard, because I'm still learning the rest of the uh, side of the game. So, everybody have a good day. Big Sway 225. And I'm out.